Hey, good morning, guys, and welcome to Tahuya. Uh, this is a park, for, it's an off-road park, basically, but we camped out here last night after wrapping up uh, this Toyota Tacoma at the Overland Truck Store. Basically, have been working on this truck for, well, a couple years. It's gone through a lot of different iterations, and uh, it's come a really long ways. And now, it's kind of in its final form. We'll say that for now. I don't want to work on it anymore. I want to use it. And so today's actually going to be the first day where we're going to test the truck with everything hypothetically working. So we got uh, lockers front and rear installed a couple episodes ago. We got them working yesterday. Um, we've got Marlin Crawler RCLT kit locked suspension all around. Um, it's really, really exciting. We're going to start off with some breakfast here and then um, at some point today, I'm going to give you guys a complete walk around of this truck and talk about every modification that we've done to it, um, everything that makes it the truck that it is right now. And I'm not even kidding. This is this is a hundred thousand dollar Toyota Tacoma. It's 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 kind of gross, um, <laughs> but uh, it is so awesome. It's come so far and it's super capable. There's a few little small things here and there that we're going to eventually do to it, but um, but yeah. So stick around. Enjoy the video. We're going to be wheeling today. We're going to be camping today. We're going to do a complete walk around. It's going to be a fun, it's going to be a really fun episode. So right now I'm attempting to cook a meal on this forever stove. It's a really cool little concept. I, I showed it in a, in a recent video. We're finally going to put it to the test. I have it loaded in this box with some wood. Got it started. These chunks of wood feed it and we're hopefully able to put a pan up here and cook ourselves some eggs. Taylor's uh, he's doing the old way. <laughs> it's a proven standard. Sure, sure. Making a grilled sandwich. Sure, I did. Yeah. Brown bread. With the brown bread. Sabav! So this is probably disgusting, but it's kind of cool. I have this, this this tailgate insert. It's like a cutting board circuit. I'm gonna ignore the fact that I sat right here with my dirty ass. <laughs> I've stepped all over it with my gross shoes. So I don't have a cutting board right now. All right, guys, this is kind of crazy. I just aired down all of the tires on this truck and um, you would not think it by looking at it, but they're all at three and a half PSI. Now these Mickey Thompson tires have like a super thick sidewall and they're still pretty new, but you would not think that that's three and a half PSI. I mean, that one kind of looks low, but um, yeah, I'm, I'm excited for all the traction. It's gonna be badass. Maybe I went too low. Uh, now, now it's starting. It just they take so long to actually to actually bulge out. They look lower now. This is gonna be fun. This is what your front compartment should look like. FJ transfer case, radio talk to buddies. There's a buddy. We got <laughs> twin cases and a pistol. Well, look who it is. If it ain't the Overland Truck Store boys. Hi, Kyle. <laughs> Hi.
towards me just a hair. We can get that tire up. Your front locker's not working. It's not on? Uh-uh. Okay, that's my ABD switch. Let's see if it works now. Nice! Yeah, way big. Way different. Oh, wow. I can't even see where I'm going, but I don't know that it matters. I think his rear bumper's on a rock. Oh, yeah. It's that rock and the back pass. Same right. one that was hanging Same right. one, yeah. Okay, I know what to do, I think. <laughs> Punch it. Punch it. Punch it, yeah. I know what to do. It's that thing.
so much ground clearance. This thing's awesome. It feels so sketchy inside. Oh, it's so tippy. Yeah. Uh, That's crazy. Showing my dash. <laughs> it is really funny. None of that means anything to me anymore. That's the best part. Well, you know, it's not Christmas time anymore. No. But like, so this is what this is what my dash always looked like with all of the electronic issues. But now it doesn't matter. None of it means anything. Don't you have electrical tape? We could. Yeah. Yeah. But not my. Okay, this is a combo I haven't tried yet. I'm gonna do the uh, secondary transfer case, the taco box, in its lowest position, and the FJ transfer case in its high kind of a good uh has a nice range it's, it's a little bit lower than the stock low but it's not like low low if that makes sense Come off of the rocks too. It's just smooth. That was really cool. That was so yeah, you're really inspiring everyone here no. to get IFS. Yeah, that was sick. That was sick. guys we just wrapped up an awesome day out here at Tahuya. we were able to tackle yellow jacket and the 55 trail both have been modified since last time i've been here and uh they're a lot of fun you can tell they've moved the rocks around yellow jacket was a little easier but a great like first start for this truck to confirm that everything's working i'm so pleased with the truck guys like it is it's really incredible to see how well it flexes and how it compares to like old school wheelers to a solid axle jeep like I'm really, really happy to be able to keep up, feel like my truck's reliable, and uh, and just have fun. Like that was probably the most fun I've had wheeling in a long time. So really, really happy with the truck. Really impressed with the clearance the RCLT gives you. That clearance under the front is just insane. Like our homemade skid plate, it felt like it took like a few impacts, but really it floated over the top of like massive rocks that I was expecting to hit. And so the whole thing was just, it was so dialed, like that was a ton of fun. So 
Um, that's going to be it for today's video. I hope that you guys enjoyed that. We plan on getting out and doing a lot more content. We want to wheel this thing even harder. So make sure you're subscribed. Make sure you hit the thumbs up button because it helps get this video out in front of people like you. And uh, it helps me out a ton as well. So uh, that's it for today's video. Get some work done this week, but don't forget to live. All right, bye.